All right, so we're out here at Ravencliff Falls, and I just got the word that the trail might be impassable. So we're gonna find out how impassable this trail is here at Ravencliff Falls. Let's keep moving. It is gone, baby, gone. Let's keep moving. Whoa. It's pretty cool about that tree being down. I ran into a couple, actually say two couples, and they said, hey, you know, how far is this trail going? And I'm like, two and a half, maybe three miles. So there's a tree that's been knocked down. We can't get across it. Well, obviously they didn't get across it, but besides them, I think I got this whole place to myself. All right, so we are coming up on the first waterfall. It looks like it's a little slippery, but I think it's worth it. Let's go check it out. Well, that was fun. I tell you, this place is packed full of waterfalls. And I know I got a bunch of my hiker friends that would love to see this place. Like Jason, like Buckley, like Crow. So if you want to go, let me know. Let's keep moving. Wow, so as you can see, it's just an incredible place. Very fortunate to have this place to myself. It's always that eerie feeling when you're out in the wilderness and am I alone? But who cares? I mean, at the end of the day, these woods have been around a lot longer than me. So I'm just exploring them, having my time here. Just like others time will come and pass through these areas. But I'm just grateful I get to share it with all of you guys. Again, Ravencliff Falls is one of my favorite places to camp and hike in all of Georgia. Whoa, that was pretty insane. Getting down that close. Oh look, there's another area. Okay, I guess the top of the falls. There we go. Cool. Uh -oh. All right, so that's pretty cool. Don't get to see that very often. It's one of my favorite places though. I've been coming here for over 20 years and for good reason too, I mean, place just doesn't quit. Waterfall after waterfall, let's keep moving. Starting to warm up a bit. Probably about to take off this puffy. In case you don't see, it's the Mont Bell Plasma 1000. This is one of my new pieces of gear for 21. Love it. Thousand fill down. Can't go wrong here. Used it on the Red River Gorge, kept me warm. This morning it was in the 20s. No problem. But as you start getting hiking, I'm starting to sweat. So it's time to take this bad boy off. So as you can see behind me, <laughs> watch your stuff. But if you can get down there, it's a pretty awesome spot to check out. This is like waterfall number three or four. I don't know. We got a few more to see. Let's keep moving. Now, I don't know. You guys tell me. What do you think about this group camping spot here? Just down the way is Ravencliff Falls. We're about two miles in or so, but plenty of spaces. Lots of places for hammock campers, so I think this is a great spot. So here's the back end of that camp spot. You got running water. Look at this. Incredible place to camp. It's beautiful. So beautiful. Alright. So this is Ravencliff Falls right here. In fact, there's a trail that goes up and over. I've never been up that way. 
Who knows, today might be the day to do that. Feeling a little bit better. Hurt my back in the Red River Gorge. But now, I might be able to scramble up that. What do you think? <laughs> All right, so we made it to the top of Ravenclaw Falls, and as you can see behind me, the views are incredible. Only 2.5 miles in, and there's lots of great campsites all along the way, so if you've never been here before, I definitely recommend checking out hiking and camping here at Ravenclaw Falls. With that being said, let's keep moving. All right, so that's that. We just did a hike up to Ravencliff Falls. Got to use my new Ultra Press, which is really cool. In case you haven't seen me talking about my Ultra Light Grail, this just came out. Weighs a little over 12 ounces, and it is a perfect day filter water filtration, even for extended hikes. I mean. I love this thing so much because it removes viruses as well as bacteria, as well as other particulates in the water. So it's been a great piece of gear to add to my collection in 2021. So if you're looking for a perfect water filter to take on trail, make sure you check out the Grail Ultra Press. It is incredible. I definitely recommend it. Not so bad, not so graceful either. Let's keep moving. All right, so that's that. We just completed a five mile hike here at Ravencliff Falls. So if you found any value in this video, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and send me your comments as I do respond. As always, thanks for watching, but until next time, let's keep moving.